you say, Beth? I'm no, saying I'm in a very remote area. I don't know if it can be hard. Oh, well, you're getting a very good signal. You, can see you, you, well. you look as if you're floating on a cloud. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see. Um, we have Fidel has joined us now. And Cesar has joined us now. Welcome, Damas. And Kwaminu from Myanmar, all the way across to Southeast Asia. Excellent. Zawadi, I can see her now. Sorry, that's my alarm clock telling me to get up. <laughs> Hello, Damas. The mask driving someone? Yes, Bill. How are you? Hello. Hey, I'm fine. How are you? Man, is you, you in, hello, Thomas. Are you in your car office? I'm fine. I'm fine. How are you? Fine. Is that your office or is it your car? Or are the two things the same? His office car. <laughs> It's the office car, right? Okay. I can't see here. Oh, okay, sorry. Well, never mind. Okay. Right, we now have Sabina who joined us. Everybody put your cameras on. Today is an all camera day. You will get no punch or Hello, Ken. Ken, Ken, how are you? Hi. Hi. Hello. Nice to hear from you. Yes, All right, I'm going to wait for two more people and we're going to get underway. That fell like cooking live. about 7.04. Um, welcome, everybody. And um, as I said, everybody wants to put on cameras today. Uh, you have good bandwidth. It's good to have your friends see each other. So, uh, but what you might want to do is but put your microphone on. Just because it's a little loud. It's, I'm just muting everybody who is on right now because it's a little loud. Who is uh, Robert Mark? Is that uh, Robert Conza? Yeah, that's me. Hey, Robert, how are you? I'm joining using my phone still. It's raining out here, so. Uh, okay. Sorry. That's right. We can hear you. That's the important thing. So. So today is a great day. Um, 
We all made it over the finish line. Uh, this was a uh, pilot course, as I told you probably several times during the uh, course of the last several months and uh, definitely in the interview, the uh, evaluation filled out. So what that means is that we made up the course as we went along. Um, we, Q has taught this MIS course face to face many, many times all over Africa and even elsewhere. Uh, but we had to adapt the course that's a face to face course to an online course. So with the help of Andrew and with all of you, uh, we were able to pull that off. So it was a pilot. We learned a few things. All of you gave us some really good feedback in the evaluation forms, and we really appreciate that. That's how we're going to build the next iteration of the course to be better and make it uh, more accessible for students and uh, hopefully increase the amount of learning. Although from the look at the post assessments, uh, most everybody really learned a lot from the program. Um, and um, you will hopefully in some way or another stay connected to us and to this program and be able to give us uh, your feedback as you start using the MIS and start learning things. Uh, Hugh is certainly available to answer your questions and um, he's looking for that feedback because it is a new version that we rolled out for this course. So that's all really very exciting. I, I also want to uh, recognize that um, this was not the only thing that you had to do in your life. You have families, you have very important jobs, which is the reason why you were in this course in the first place, uh, and you have the rest of life that you have to navigate in the course of uh, meeting each assignment and uh, making sure that you get everything in on time. And um, I really appreciate the level of effort that was shown in this course. It was really uh, terrific, uh, a lot of commitment and uh, support for each other, and, and that's what makes a good online experience uh, even better, is to have a real a uh, sense of community and a sense that everybody's kind of in this together. So really appreciate that. Despite the fact that um, we're in um, five different time zones uh, all over the African continent and uh, way over in Myanmar. So uh, I think that that's uh, exemplary. Um, we, as I said, we will be offering this course again. Um, just a little background is that um, SMDP uh, has been at the University of New Hampshire um, I created it in 2009 from a previous program called the Microenterprise and Development Institute. Uh, both Andrew and uh, Hugh had experience with that program. Um, Hugh was an instructor in the program, um, and Andrew was actually a student in 2007. So you all joined the ranks of about 20 700 students from around the world who have been a part of this program that we've offered in eight countries and online and um, it's really been a great thing. In the last uh, several years it's been largely due to the MasterCard Foundation scholarships that we've been able to run the course. So um, appreciate you being part of something that we started back in 1999 and has continued in one form or another since then two different names and two different universities, uh, but it's been a great experience. So, so what I want to do right now, um, we're going to have as a final thing, the certificate ceremony. And if you um, haven't got yourself some type of a beverage, you should have that ready because we will be having a toast. Um, sorry, we cannot provide beverages. It's against the law to provide beverages over the internet. Something about connectivity and explosions and fires. Um, but uh, we will, um, now I'd like to do is I didn't ask them to do this, but I would like uh, Mr. Andrew and Mr. Hugh to give us a few reflections on um, their experience with this course. And then what I'm gonna do is open it up to get some, some uh, well wishes from anybody uh, out there that would like to say anything. So, but let me start with uh, Hugh, Alan, and Hugh, um, anything you would like to offer for your re reflections on this course uh, for the students this morning, this afternoon. And you're, and you're muted. By yeah, the sure. Uh, you are. You're no longer no, muted. No, no, okay. Well, the first thing I'm gonna tell you is that it's a whole lot more work than if you're doing it face to face, at least for me. <laughs> but once you've got it in place, it's there for the future. If 
But the point about it is that uh, what makes it difficult is that you have a very short period of time to do the instructions. Like when you're in a face-to-face -face workshop, you're able to sort of uh, overemphasize and underscore and revisit and really work things through in a very intensive fashion. So the challenge in an online course is to get uh, precise, accurate, useful information that is easily absorbed and applied correctly. So this is the first time we've done this, and we really want to know if that, in fact, is the case. If, you've, if you have been able to understand the system, if you feel it's accessible, but we also want to find out where we, you think we could have improved, where we could have done better in terms of uh, uh, the materials content, the, the webinars, uh, areas in terms of the MIS where you feel there is a gap in your understanding because we're going to do this again uh, in the coming year and we'd like to we'd like to improve it so you you are our, you're our guinea pigs our first graduates and like like a good guinea pig in a laboratory we want to get a lot of data out of you so the most important thing for us is to first of all to acknowledge your participation uh, to to we're very grateful for the fact that you participated as intensively as you can, and the feedback that we get from you is, is of vital importance. One thing I would like to say is this. This is the first time we've done it. Going forward, you may face challenges. And I've noticed that many of you go, are, are quite silent, um, and I know from experience that, that, so, that it's not always easy to fully absorb things, especially when somebody is just talking and showing something on a computer screen. I just want to stress again, as you start to use the system and you run into challenges, please contact me or Andrew uh, and use Skype because you can use an email, of course, to ask a question. But if you want to get some feedback which involves helping you with your system online, then we can do that over Skype. But I want to say to you, this has been uh, a first for me as well. It's my first online course. And I've learned a lot as well. So I'm very grateful to you for your participation and to your unfailing good manners and humor. So thanks very much. Indeed. Thanks. Thank you, Hugh. And uh, Andrew, could we um, words from I'd you? I'd also like to say how grateful I am to all the students. Uh, it was very clear right at the beginning that not many people actually had experience in doing this kind of uh, learning. Or this kind of learning was very new for most. And it, it took a bit of time for a number of people to realize they could actually reach out through Skype and actually get help. But when people did, I think, you know, you know the learning speed actually improved. And a number of people, I, I think, have appreciated uh, the the interactions we, 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 we did and how we helped them to actually get used to the system. I'm also going to say that like you, that um, uh, we are actually very available. You know, I know when you actually start setting up your system, for those who don't have it, who are not on um, cervix, you will begin to get challenges, but you don't need to worry because we actually are Skype uh, text away and we can help. Now for those who would, would appreciate uh, a bit more learning, as in hands-on. We are available. I mean, if, uh, if you, you want to talk to your organization, you want to pull up further, give you personalized attention. Very, very easy to help you set up your yeah. Use Skype, but uh, yeah, if you want to help hands-on, we are available. But thank you very much for your effort. It's been very fascinating just seeing how students have improved when, uh, when we've helped them uh, on Skype or email. Thank you, Andrew. And that was a really good point, is that um, looking at when you, you first came into the course, very few of you had had any experiences with online learning. So you had an opportunity to learn about online learning while you learned about the MIS. And I think it's a double challenge and you all did it with great aplomb. So congratulations to you. Uh, so what I want to do is just uh, spend a few minutes to see if anybody uh, has any well wishes. And if you um, want to turn on your camera, all the better. Um, I know some of you have connectivity issues. 
Uh, so we'll see what we can do. But um, if you're going to be speaking, if you could turn on your camera, we'll see how it works. That'd be great. And then at the uh, end, I'm going to take a group picture with everybody. And um, everybody have their cameras on then so we can see your faces. So uh, anybody have anything they'd like to say to uh, Hugh or Andrew or to the group? And you have to unmute your microphone to do that. It's just minor detail. A quiet group this afternoon. Uh, what was the, I'll throw out a couple questions here. What was the hardest part of the last three months for anyone? You want to talk about what, on any aspect of either the course or fitting that course into your life, what was for you the greatest challenge of three months? Go ahead, Prudence. I'm unmuting Prudence. Oh, I'm trying to unmute Prudence and it's not working. Hmm. Beth's a bad there. Okay. Uh, if yeah, someone wants to write something in the chat. Yeah. So uh, go hello. ahead. Go ahead. Well, hello everybody. We can hear you, Tammy. Hello. Yes. Um, we can hear you. I, I think. Um, of course, I'm going to say thank you again. I did say thank you um, in the evaluation, particularly to Andrew for always being a Skype away, and also to you for the great facilitation, and as well as to you too, Williams, to my colleagues for the very interesting um, conversations we had. Um, I, I think that um, the fact that we could type in um, our experiences for me was better because um, at night I had the opportunity to always sit back again and reread all the discussions, you know. So for me, that was a very, very good part. Uh, but the difficult part, of course, in answering your question was, um, um, I, I guess, the same challenge everybody had, connectivity, you know. So you want to spend some more time on, on the service web, on the Savix website. Um, but then, you know, your internet is failing you and all of that. But I'm sure that it's work in progress and it's something that we will get better at doing. But again, I'm going to say thank you. And I don't know, Williams, I, I think um, it would be good if we could still have the conversations up on Canvas for some more time, you know, or do you think that we should just go and extract the conversations we've had with the remaining members of the team. So, um, to answer, we are um, keeping the course up until the 28th of uh, December. Okay. But if you wanted me to extend that a little bit, uh, maybe to the 15th of January, I can do that. And then that okay. way, if anybody wanted to capture anything that was there. Um, exactly. So mainly it would be conversations or PowerPoints. Um, you all received uh, on modules, Hugh put up the entire manual in its, uh, without broken up into different sections. So you have the entire revised manual and you can take that and uh, download that. But after January, it'll all disappear. Um, thank you. Let's see, we have students uh, who has, the chat box. I just, uh, I would just like to, I just like to throw in a response to uh, what Tommy Tope had to say. Um, uh, you, you were talking about the issue of connectivity, right? Um, yes. And of course, if you're going to enter data into the system or produce reports, you need to be online. But um, the mobile application that we've developed uh, also allows you to enter data into the system. Offline, you can enter data into the system offline, and then you can synchronize it periodically when you've got data from 40 or 50 groups. 
Uh, we've got the we've got the uh, manual in how to use the mobile application, and I, I'm trying to remember if I actually did include it. But if I didn't, I'll put it into the Dropbox folder, and you can take a look at it. Uh, it's it's very very useful in areas of low connectivity because you can go offline, collect, save, and as I say, synchronize. Yeah. Thank you, Hugh. I think that would be really really appreciated. And that's a good point that Hugh brought up uh, that I didn't mention is there is a Dropbox folder that has a lot of documents in it, uh, pretty much everything from the course. Uh, we'll clean that up, make sure that uh, everything is the way we want it, and we will resend the link to you so that everybody has the link and you can go in there even when uh, Canvas disappears in a few weeks. Okay. Uh, Thank you. We have a message from Prudence that I'm going to read. She says, for me, I want to say thank you very much. This was a great experience. Using the online course and complimenting it with Skype to reach out to the lecturers was good, but I really appreciate Hugh and Andrew for always being available. I'm planning that, planning that as soon as I come back from the Christmas uh, break, I create my uh, MIS because this is one of the key deliverables my boss is expecting. And I really appreciate that Hugh and Andrew will always be there to offer us support. So thank you, Prudence, appreciate those comments. And uh, Fidel has uh, offered, um, that's to say the most appreciated thing about the course is the support from the facilitators, thank you so much. And um, this is another one from Prudence. That's great, especially now that you're talking about the introduction of the mobile application to complement for poor internet connectivity. Yeah, I think that's the goal is to make this as usable as possible. So even if you're in the field, you'd be able to access the data um, really from anywhere. Um, really try to make it a uh, lean, low profile program so that um, connectivity will not be a big problem. So do we have others who would like to offer anything? Uh, you can offer that by talking uh, on the screen, putting your video on and talking to us directly, or you can Type it into the chat box. Just so you know who we have with us, you probably can see we have Damas and Nibway. Welcome, Nibway. Um, Cesar, Sabina, Abby, Kiamenu, uh, Kinkin from Neymar, um, Dawadi, and Robert Gonza. And did I leave anybody out? Oh, Fidel. We up there in the corner. Any other comments you would like to offer? Is your time together, friends? All right. Hello. Go ahead. Who's that? Looks like Abby's. Hello. Abby, are you talking without unmuting yourself? Yeah, yeah I'm Jomino. Oh, hi. Hello. Jomino. Hi. Who's? Yeah, I would like to say thank you. Oh, uh, yeah, pass. Uh, my Sarah, uh, William, you and Andrew. Yeah, I, I have got. It is my first time learning from online course, internet class. Uh, I had never experienced about this, uh, but uh, I have learned so much experience. And but I needed to try so much uh, for reading everything and for for submitting assignment and discussion and for everything. I needed to get time so much, but uh, I'm not I'm not good at uh, good at education. Uh, sorry, I'm not good at uh, English uh, for writing. Yeah, uh, it is really I need I need some things. Yeah, for my effort. Yeah. Look, can you hear me? Yes, we can hear you. Yeah. First, uh, I would like to say all oh, because uh, yeah. my English is so bad. Uh, that's why uh, I needed to try so much. Uh, but uh, I'm trying the best uh, uh, for submitting everything, uh, for discussion. Uh, thank you, Andrew, for helping me on Skype. <laughs> and, and, um, but I, I have learned uh, to be better in my VSLA, uh, VSLA creating MIS. Uh, I will use, I will use those uh, if it, it is really needed uh, in my organization. I will create uh, to be better from your data source, yeah. Uh, 
Yes. Uh, uh, I don't know how to tell now. Um, I I already say so much. Uh, in my, I'm just I was just thinking about uh to tell so much. Uh, yeah, in my in my heart, but uh, I can say so much in here. <laughs> Thank you so much. Yeah. Bye bye. Thank you, Kim. Oh, we we appreciate yeah. it. Your English is is good and getting better. So appreciate you working on that as well. You were, you had a trip yeah. curve. You had to learn about online. You had to learn about MRI. Yeah. You had to learn English. So all three things. Um, yeah. A lot to do. Yeah, it is. Yeah, it is my first time this wine. So I'm just worried. Uh, I'm I'm afraid. Yeah, this wine. Yeah, you're you're doing great. Thank you all. You are very kind of us. Yeah. For learning and for talking easily, talking slowly, that's why it is. It was really useful for us. Yeah, it was really useful. But uh, but as for me, uh, I needed to try so much because uh, I need I needed to get time for learning everything. Uh, but so I will I will review all of, all of MIS and all the webinar to be better for use in my organizations. Yes, I will use well. Well, good luck. Thank you all. Yeah, thank yes, you so thank, much. Thank you. We appreciate thank your work. You. Yeah. Thanks. Hello? Uh, we, yes, who's that? Sabina. Hi, Sabina. Hello, Sabina. Hi. Looks like you're getting ready for a, a fire right there. You have, you've got <laughs> fire temperature next to your head. So, mm -hmm. no smoking. <laughs> Go ahead, Sabina. Sorry. Okay. Making a joke. Yeah. Uh, okay. Okay. Uh, we are preparing ourselves for Christmas, and uh, I don't have a, a graduation gown today. Hello. It looks, like it looks like you have a nice gown on. <laughs> yeah, it's just a dress. It's not a graduation gown. I saw people with ties and the good shirts of Will. Yeah. Anyway, yeah. Uh, the. The, the learning was uh, very excited to me uh, from using the canvas. It was my first time. So before doing that, I was so excited. Hey, how am I going to you to understand this? Because using the canvas, the new uh, uh, software for me, and it, it gets really excited. But most I wanted it to, to learn was uh, on the cervix structures, uh, well to understand how it works. And uh, I'm, I'm, I'm so grateful because I got to understand it. I saw it online. I saw people using it, but I wasn't able to use it. Uh, so for me, it's a, a, it's, a, it's a career advance. It's work improvement. And I'm sure with my other team, it can help us uh, to the better implementation of our program. We have a number of groups, and uh, I think it's a useful uh, uh, tool to use to track the, the, the saving group's progress. Uh, Otherwise, uh, I would say it was also a bit challenging, uh, considering time on our side. Uh, the time is time for work, and at some point you will find yourself on the field or you are in a meeting. So there's um, some issues of time we have to, to adjust. Though uh, we appreciate because the I mean the information come us come to us earlier, like one week before. So you organize yourself, and thanks God I was able to attend all the. The session, almost all the session, I think except one. And the, the only issues that uh, is uh, maybe we need to, to improve uh, is on uh, the webinars. Sometimes you find, uh, I think because of the people being located in different places, but the network, the recording of the webinar, sometimes you find it's clashing. You can't hear uh, well, I mean, clear on what people are asking or the interaction people are making during the live. Uh, sessions. So when we think about if anything that I mean for the future, maybe we can improve on the on the recordings of the webinar so that it can be easy for the reviewers to get the concept well. Thank you. Otherwise, thank you to Andrew. Thank you to to the to the facilitators, including Bill, Andrew, and Hu. Uh, you have been helpful for for me to understand. At some points, I try to do something. Uh, trying to do different things, but I come to understand it uh, and learn well through the support of the, the facilitators. Again, for the people who were late submitting your assignments, uh, we are able to do uh, all the assignments, and I'm grateful for that.
And I'll thank you. Thank you so much, Sabina. We appreciate your, your kind words and uh, your due diligence uh, several weeks. And, and as we've mentioned, connectivity is an issue and we hope it's going to get better over time. Um, we experience connectivity issues in the United States as well. So it's just kind of a part of living with this technology. Um, we have a couple more comments that have come in on the chat box. Uh, this is from um, uh, a very fascinating group of three people, very determined to follow up and always available to help. Gracias. You, I'll follow up for the MIS sometime later next year. Thanks, Andrew, for the last minute. So, thank you, Nimway from Tanzania. We really appreciate your comments. And we have um, from Prudence. Um, thank you, William, for providing all the necessary support and doing all the administration work, which resulted in our journey in the past few months being an easy one. You're always there to help us as well. This is from Kinkin. Um, Kinkin says, I have never been um, attending. Um, I'll sit here. I never attended an online course. This is the first time for me. So I got great experience. So thank you very much uh, for my organization and uh, YouTube. And before I attended an online course, I think it'll be difficult. But now that it's easy because of a good system, thanks a lot for supporting me. And I'm trying to use it practically in my job. Excellent. Wonderful, Kinkin. Appreciate your words. And um, hopefully your boss will give you a big Christmas bonus because you did this course. Sorry. Um, and this is from uh, Wadi. Uh, correct. This is my first time to learn online, and it was a great experience for me. Everything was okay, especially all supports I got from the lecturers. And hope it'll be. Hope I will be able to practice to do practically what I learned. Thank you very much, Mr. Hugh. Andrew Williams. Yeah. Thank you very much, Sawadi. All right, anybody else? I'd like to offer some well wishes before we move on to the exciting ceremony to hand out certificates. All right, so what I'm going to do here, some of you um, who live in Uganda, already received your certificates and if you want to hold them up to your camera when i announce your uh name then that's fine um that'll be at the end um otherwise i'm going to be holding up the certificates that i'm going to be sending to everybody and uh inshallah they will arrive somehow or other uh, we have a number of different ways we're sending them to addresses in the united states we're sending via courier to some addresses in Africa. And um, we did have Hugh who's gonna hand carry um, Timotopes when he goes to Abuja next month. So one way or another, we'll get these to you. Uh, these certificates are paper with a foil um, medallion on them. I'm gonna show you just one, there's for Inez. Uh, but I wanna tell you a little story is that um, a few years back, I had a correspondence from a former student from one of our courses, and um, the gentleman told me that his house had been destroyed in a fire, and he had lost everything, and he was hopeful that I could send him a copy of his certificate, and I thought that was pretty significant. If you lost everything in your fire, and one of the things that you need to try to replace is your certificate from attending this course, um, or it was a previous course, but I, I, um, I thought that was great. So we definitely got him the certificate. Um, so hold on to these. They're, they're uh, not exactly a degree from uh, Harvard or from um, Eaton or something like that, but um, you did work hard for them. So um, let's see, we have actually one more comment that's come in uh, from Cesar. Uh, the course was just fantastic. We'll continue to look up with and Andy for the next four weeks as we migrate to Savix using their revised tools. Thank you, Cesar, appreciate it. Um, all right, so now without further ado, what I'm gonna do, so when I hold up your certificate, I want to uh, take a picture of the, by all means, um, take a picture of your screen, that's great. And I see that Christopher has joined us. Uh, welcome Christopher, Christopher is way out in the field 
um, using his phone, but the connectivity is enough that I can see the trees and I can see his face. So welcome, Christopher. Glad you're here. All right. So what I'm going to do is um, I'm going to read the name of uh, each individual. And if you want to unmute your mic and clap, make a big noise for everybody. This is what we do. We're in a face-to-face -face course. We would um, have you come up and we'd give you the certificate. You'd shake Mr. Hughes' hand uh, and Mr. Andrew and, and me if I was there. Um, so yeah, we just do a, a virtual shake and, um, and then we'll give you your certificate. And then eventually you'll actually get the certificate. So, so the first person we would like to recognize is Masheka Zawade Inez. There we go. I'm going to actually this. And let's hear it for Maseka. Yay. Yay. A round of applause. So that's great. Thank you. <laughs> um, hold on a second here. I have an idea. Stand by. All right, next we have, I don't think she's actually with us, so I'm only going to give out the certificates. I did. That's a little early there. Um, the only people who I guess certificates are the ones that show up. Yes. So what happens in life? You don't get things if you show up. So I'm sure that um, some of us had other things we needed to do. So um, from Myanmar, congratulations, Kia Minu. Hi. Uh, <laughs> uh, next, you. next, we also have from Myanmar, Kin Kin Tan. Congratulations, Kin Kin. Uh, Congratulations. Uh. <laughs> Congratulations. <laughs> um, Hello. Let's see, do we still have Beth with us? She was with us before, but her connection was not good. So we'll see if she comes back. We'll hold off on Beth for right now. Um, we have Prudence Mnizi. Well, congratulations, Prudence. Ah, <laughs> congratulations. Uh. <laughs> All right. Uh, let's uh. see. We do not have... Um, goes like unfortunately, so we'll move on. Um, let's see, do we have Faith? Is Faith with us? Faith could not make it today either, sorry, Faith. Um, but we do have Mr. Robert Gonza. Congratulations, Robert. Yeah! Woo! Wow, they really are going crazy for Robert. <laughs> <laughs> you need to do that again so that they make some noise for me. <laughs> okay, we have next Hobikele Limbwe. Congratulations, Hobikele. Awesome. And we have Mr. Cesar Pachale. Congratulations, Cesar. Congratulations, Caesar. Getting some uh, some kind of other YouTube sound here. Sorry. <laughs> so much for technology. Okay, we have to the applause effects sound here. All right. Congratulations, to Caesar. Uh, next we have. I think he is with us still. We have Mr. Fidel Munizero. Congratulations, Fidel. Let's see, did we miss anybody? Um, take a Robert, uh, Daniel, where's Daniel? Oh, Daniel, you got yours in, in um, you got yours in Kampala, right? 
I haven't received it, but it's with the Baptist already. It is, okay. Well, congratulations anyways. Let's hear it for Daniel, congratulations. Thank you, thank you so much. Um, and let's see, did we miss anybody else here? Um, Sabina, Sabina, you're getting yours also via um, Abby. So congratulations to Sabina. Let's hear a big round of applause for Sabina. Oh, congratulations, Sabina. And Abby, uh, Abby is going to be carrying, you already got his, congratulations, Abby. Abby, do you have yours in front of you there? You want to show it to us? Yeah, right, I got it from Hugh, and okay. it was a great opportunity to see him. Oh, oh excellent. Well, thank you. To see that he's a real person and not just an avatar. <laughs> <laughs> um, we have a message from Daniel. He says, my sincere gratitude goes to the MasterCard Foundation for making it possible for me to attend this course. Long live MasterCard Foundation. I think we can all agree. Let's hear it for MasterCard Foundation. Thank you. Um, okay. And um, Christopher. Christopher, you also received your certificate, I believe, from Mr. Hugh. And or you will. Um, is that correct, Christopher? I can see you. I can, I don't know if I can actually hear you. Um, but we I, there you I are. Talk to Baptist today. He has a Baptist Afghan certificate. I think when he come on Tuesday, I will take it from him. Perfect. Okay. Well, congratulations to Christopher. And, uh, Thank you very much. <laughs> and now we have, oh, there's John Baptiste has just joined us. Welcome, John Baptiste. We're going to congratulate John Baptiste for also completing the course. Let's hear it for John Baptiste. Yay. Um, and then we have um, Tempetope, uh, who will get a certificate in sometime during January when Hugh goes to Abuja. Congratulations, Tematope. Let's hear it for Tematope. All right. Um, Faith. Faith has her certificate right here. Just to Faith, she's not on, but if she happens to watch this, congratulations to Faith. Congratulations, and, um, The other people who aren't here will, in case they watch this video, will congratulate them. We have... Uh, Banda, congratulations, Ngoza. And we have Beth. Nalaboka, uh, Beth Masanga. Congratulations, Beth. And um, hopefully I didn't, didn't miss anybody. Is there anybody who I did miss? So we had Caesar, Robert, Christopher, Sawadi. I think we got everyone. Okay. Well, again, um, I want to thank everybody for all of your hard work, for your dedication, for being guinea pigs, because this was, as I said, a pilot. Um, we're all learning together, learning as we go, and I think uh, the outcome was, was very good. Um, just to remind people, if you came on, we're going to try to keep everything up uh, till about mid uh, January on Canvas, and then everything else is uh, either migrated or will be migrated over to uh, Canvas, I mean, or, or to Dropbox, and we'll send you that uh, link. Um, what I would like to do is, if everybody could, at the, for the last few minutes here, uh, turn your cameras on, and I can try to take a group picture, that would be great. Um, who I can, who I don't see right now is Fidel, Kinkin, uh, Wadi, I think Robert doesn't have a camera. Um, Camu, Camu, and Cesar. So if you all could turn on your cameras, and we'll have one final group shot of everybody who's here. Um, I think we might have lost Andrew. Is Andrew still with us? His oh, there no Andrew's still there. Oh, yeah. Sorry, Andrew, we're slipping on the side there. Andrew's um, there. Okay. So I can see Fidel. The only people we can't see now are Cesar and Sabina. So Cesar and Sabina can see Sabina. 
and then we just get Caesar on and have everybody. Caesar might be having some activity issues. Uh, I see we have someone's child joining us. That's great. Um, all right, so I'm going to take a group shot. So first of all, everybody, just give me a smile. Um, this is just the everybody act normal, smile, and there's a shot. Lit. Um, one more of those to be sure. All right. Hopefully in a second, I've actually got to save this as we do it. And now this one is going to be everybody waving. So everybody wave like you're at a football match and you're all going nuts. The crowd is going wild. They're all waving their hands off. Excellent. Okay, that's good. And um, I know sometimes you get these photographers and they ask you to do ridiculous things. So they ask you to make a ridiculous face, and that's what we're going to do right now. Make any kind of ridiculous face that you'd like, or hand signal, or whatever you want there. Everybody act a little goofy. Come on. You can do it. A pretty reserved group. <laughs> All right. Um, and finally, uh, if everyone could find a beverage of your choice, and um, I would like to propose a toast to all of you for all of your hard work, for all of your dedication, and most importantly, for the work that you do. The work, the savings group work that you do is really critical. Uh, the learning that you're doing is going to make a big difference to everybody um, in your organizations to have better data and know what's going on so you can serve the people that you're serving better and keep your donors happy and make changes in people's lives. So to all of you, cheers. We seem to have lost Hugh. He's not, Hugh, where's your drink, man? Get on the program here. Cheers, cheers. Uh, you know, the British, they're just so stodgy. It's hard to get them. Okay, there you go. All right. Um, let me see if there are any final messages here. Uh, John, well, listen, I've just, I've, yes, I've just, <laughs> I've just got an Irish passport, so don't be rude about it. You can be as rude as you like about the British. <laughs> oh, you're Irish now, are you? Okay, how convenient. I'm going to be Canadian before long, the way things are going, so. Um, all right, uh, we also have a message here uh, from Jean Baptiste who says, thank you everyone for making it to the end. All right. Uh, and it says, Daniel has raised his hand. I don't know what happens when someone raises your hand. But in any event, um, looks like John Baptiste is on a very bumpy road, or he's dancing, one or the other. Uh, but listen to some really good music in his car. Um, all right. Thank you, everyone, again. Uh, just for fun, I am going to put this video up on uh, the Canvas screen under Module 6. Uh, it will be at the end there in case you want to see it. And take any snapshots or whatever. Uh, I will do my best to get the certificate, remaining certificates to everybody in the next few weeks. And um, as we've said several times, please don't hesitate to be in touch with Andrew or Hugh. And um, if anybody does have outstanding work uh, for me, um, as far as the, um, I think all of the MasterCard um, forms are in. I think there was a couple of people that had a um, couple other things to do, but please get those into me. So we're, we're all by the holidays in a week, we're not having to worry about stuff that includes me personally. I won't have to be worrying about stuff. Um, and um, I think we're, we're really in great shape. Um, thank you again. Wishing everybody a really great holiday season. Um, be safe. Um, have a nice time with your friends. And then get back in January to do the great work that you're doing on behalf of the University of New Hampshire and the SMDP and my colleagues, Andrew and Hugh, um, it was our esteemed pleasure to be uh, facilitating this course with you and, and being with you on this learning journey. And I thank you all and wish you the best.
Thank you, everybody. All right. Thanks, everybody. We are yeah. officially done with the party, but anyone who wants to hang around and continue to talk, then you can do that. Um, leave it on for a couple minutes because you can talk to each other. Um, in the meantime, we'll get back to a little fella Gucci.